got new wheels for the SEMA. I was going to wait till I lowered it, but they do look good on there. They were for the Mustang. That's why they're a little meaty. But we're going to tuck them. Some coilovers. She'll look good. You come help me, bud. Oh, there we go. All right, so I was out driving the BMW the other day, and I got two flat tires. Not a video I wanted to make, but today I'm going to be throwing... GBMW on the lift pulling off this rear tire because these don't come with a spare it's got a bunch of shit in it I was on the back roads just having some fun and then pssh, this one's got a bunch of shit in it too but it's still holding air surprisingly so yeah we're going to pop those off um Honda, the dealership that I bought the car from, replaces or repairs the tires for free. So we're going to pop those off, take them up there, see what they can do. Hopefully have it back on the road today or tomorrow. Should be a little quick one. All right, well, didn't think I'd have to put the BMW on the lift this soon, but it was actually really easy. Considering BMW likes to make their jack points a really convenient spot. I guess they just know your car is going to be on a lift a bunch. Got it pulled up on a lift. Got the wheels and tires taken off. This one was the worst one. It's like a big old corner chunked out of it. And then it's got like nails like all the way around. There's another one. These three still held air. But they both have a bunch of stuff in them as well. Uh, I don't feel like finding this. Oh, there's one right there, and this one. There's more. I just don't feel like looking for all of them right now. So hopefully, I don't think they'll be able to repair at least at least this one right here. That one's done for. I want the big chunk out of it. Um, I don't know if they'll be able to repair the other one just because they have so much stuff in them. So hopefully they just end up replacing them. Either way, replace or repair it to both free. So we shall see. Not something I wanted to do today though. And we got this little bad project where her project one, project two, project three. So yeah, you know, if you like uh, Mustangs, Euro cars, or uh, imports, you know, I guess this is the channel for you. I currently am working on a 2000 Mustang GT. Uh, this, well, I was just daily driving this, but now I'm working on my 2018 M3, and I also have a 94 E36 Coupe, which I want a Honda swap. I know those K-Series and things go wild. It's already four cylinders, so it's not like I'm ruining anything anyways. And then the SEMA up front, I just got new wheels on. It's just gonna get tent wheels and coilovers. Um, that's just gonna be like a nice little chill weekend cruiser kind of deal. So yeah, we'll be taking the tires to the Honda dealership tomorrow. We got an appointment for that. Come back tomorrow after that and hopefully put the tires back on and can drive the BMW again. I do want some new wheels for this. I was looking at some CCWs or HREs. The BBS wheels I want for this are like, I think it's like eight grand for the set. CCW is like six and some change. And I found some HREs that are actually already F8X spec for two grand without tires. It's not bad, they're gold though. I kinda wanna do triple white, so. Shut up, old man. Yeah, I was gonna wait till I put coilovers on this cause look at that. Look at that wheel gap. That's not as bad in the rear. Up front. That shit's bad. I was going to wait till I did coilovers, but I had these laying around. Figured I might as well throw them on while I can. They actually look really good. I think it's going to look sick when I just lower it a little bit. I was going to do like a VIP build, but the rears are meaty. I don't know if I'll be able to tuck down. Because they were for the Mustang. They weren't for this car. 
as you can see, it's gonna be a job and a half to tuck them big booty meats. So we'll see though. I think if I put enough camber in, I should be able to get those to tuck up in there. If not, I'll just go to like a little bit of a stretch tire. If I can pull it in some. Yes sir, I had to get that V8. Yeah, those are some of the best fucking wheels. I don't care what anyone says. Some Ordens. Not bad, not bad. So yeah. This will probably be like a two part video today and then like tomorrow when I go get tires to the BMW. So I shot a little bit of this video yesterday. Um, my friend works at a BMW dealership. He was able to squeeze me in. Got me. My new tires put on, same day. Much love, shout out to you, you know who you are. So I'm gonna throw these back on, and then throw these wheels back on, and then this thing's done for the week. I was gonna buy new wheels for it. And I just had to drop all that money on new tires. So that's gonna have to hold off for a bit, so. Yeah, for now we're just gonna throw on the stock wheels, new tires, and get it going. Got the wheels back on. Now I just need to go clean my car. Cause it's been sitting in the shop and it's gotten a little dusty and those wheels have a lot, look at that, got a lot of brake dust. So. Got those on, just gonna torque them down now that I hit them with a few Ugg Duggas. Get the wheels all torqued up and then go get her washed. And then that should, uh, should effectively conclude this video. Now that this one's all done, it was a short little tire swap video. Come to help now that I'm all done. Bless you. What? Wow. So I might as well carry it with me. So glad to have that back on the road. Alrighty.